Ciao, gente. Thank you for clicking on the video. I play PVZ and I have a horrible stutter, so please keep that in mind. And that's it. So enjoy the video, punks. Electro P. He's a P shooter variant that nobody likes, which technically means he has no friends. But that's a conversation for another day. He falls under the super rare rarity and has a few gimmicks to his name. His first gimmick is him being a detonation character, or Deto for short. Deto characters have a completely unique way of firing at their primary. Here is regular P shooter firing, and here is Electro P firing. Uh, notice any differences? For one, Deto characters I cannot have more than one bullet out at once, which means if EP shoots, he cannot fire another shot until that shot hits an object, a zombie, or is manually detonated while in the air. Though you might be asking, how the hell do you detonate a shot in the air? To detonate a shot in the air, you need to press your primary once more and then kaboom, it's detonated. So one more time, press your primary to fire a shot and then press it once more to detonate that shot you just fired. All cool? Alright, you say it, not me. There are many benefits to detonating a shot while in the air, so let's talk about them. For one, the detonated shot is a giant hitbox while in the air. A giant hitbox as in, if there's a zombie in this gigantic circle of a hitbox, they will be taking damage no matter what. Seems pretty fair to me. For two, you could abuse this detonated hitbox to attack zombies behind walls. Yep. Being able to attack you behind walls seems pretty fair to me. And the last detonation benefit is, if a zombie is in your face, you could just spam your primary button and they will be forced to take damage. Pretty damn fun stuff, huh? Electro P's second gimmick is that he's an electric character. At the electric character's damage have the ability to chain their damage on onto multiple targets, which means if there are two targets up beside each other and an electric character attacks one of them, damage will be inflicted onto the other target as, as well. The only way to avoid the electric damage is if you don't stand beside any teammate. Sadly, healing doesn't cancel the electric element. Electric P's final gimmick would be his speed. Uh, before I show anything, here is Pea Shooter walking. Cool, cool, cool. And here is Electro P walking. Now that is very balanced and not only that that extra speed will also be stacked upon what you're hyper so you could go even faster while in hyper pretty damn cool to me so not only is his character a deto electric he also has increased movement speed isn't that just super balanced of course the hardest part of this character is a the deto gimmick it's not a beginner friendly but that is it once you learn how to deto shots you don't I forget how to deto shot. It's like riding a bike with no training wheels. It's very hard at first, but once you learn, you 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 don't uh, forget. If you learn how to deto shots, that zombie player can't can't do anything. Oh piss! I forgot to mention uh, this character's damage is incredibly high. It's not like that high, uh, but like he he could four shot and most of the zombie cast. And if you're an imp, then uh, a good luck avoiding those shots? Question mark. If there's a really good electro P on plants, you just pretty much can't play the game like at all however there are some counters to this character so let's go over them one arctic trooper arctic trooper will only counter electro p if if you land the first shot and the reason for this is the electro p will be slower and eventually will be frozen and once he's frozen you pretty much win so yeah two all star electro p's dps really isn't at the highest and when all star is 200 hp he's able to out a dps electro p completely but just make sure not to hide behind your shields since he could just shoot right through them and that's not that fair and lastly super brains super brains has 200 hp and could completely stall out electro p's hyper by using turbo twister a turbo twister has insane defense so right as you see hyper being popped pop turbo twister right as he's doing that once you stall out his hyper you pretty much win the fight no matter what so in conclusion Electro P is incredibly annoying. He could attack you behind walls, move faster, and still with a P shooter, so it means he has every P shooter jank. A janks such as being able to bean jump and also just P gowling, just being flat out broken. This ability sucks. He's not the best P shooter, but he's just super 
duper annoying. It doesn't help that every max rank drools upon viewing him in the character select screen. You know what type of people these guys are. Get quote unquote PVG professionals. It's like, dude, just get a girlfriend, man. <laughs>